So I have this pick and place mechanism and I'll get to why it's called a pick and place mechanism in the next video, but I wanna start by showing you what's going on in the back because it's pretty awesome. So you'll notice that this crank right here is being driven by this motor and it has this continuous rotation. And that is translating through this rack, this linear gear here that has this kind of forward and backwards, but a little bit of a rotational motion into this pinion right here. And it's giving it this pinion, this clockwise, counterclockwise motion. What's cool about this is nowadays we'd be using computers and special motors and we would just program it to say, go forwards, go backwards, go forwards, go backwards. But 120 years ago, when a mechanism like this would have been used in production, they didn't have that luxury. So this is the kind of creative mechanical design that they had to come up with. Check that out.